Drugs or football? The choice between the two seems obvious. In fact, most collegiate players would probably give up eating candy for life if it gave them even the slightest chance to play in the NFL. But for Broncos star linebacker Vaughn Miller, doing drugs is apparently more important. When he came into the NFL two years ago, Vaughn should have been made well aware of the league's drug policy and the consequences that would fall on him for failing a test. Well, either he was never told of these rules or he simply ignored them. And now, because of his immaturity, the Denver Broncos will likely be without their best player. That's right, it's not Peyton Manning, it's Miller, for the first four games of the season. As a result, the rest of the defense will struggle mightily to stop the likes of Eli Manning and Joe Flacco, the best quarterbacks of the four teams Denver will face. Does this make Von Miller a bad person? Not quite, but it does make him selfish. His poor decision making has let down his teammates, coaches, and an entire city that has Super Bowl aspirations for the first time in years. Now, it's not time for the Broncos to say goodbye to a guy who is an absolute freak of nature on the field. But, the message to Von Miller should be clear and concise. It's time to grow up. Fast. Nick Heeman, 9 News.